Chelly, I think you should come with us. We're going to the strip club. I got some big tips tonight. Let's spin them the American way. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> no, what? Tits. Drugs. Food. Yes. Parking tickets. Excuse me, uh, we, we weren't ready. We were asking you what this side bet was, and you dealt the card. It's only money. You shit. I hope you die tonight. You know what? I'll fuck your corpse. I'm just trying to save, you know? I don't want to work this job forever. What, but this is the best job there is. Whatever kind of job would you want? Something more exciting. Something more exciting. You want exciting? Just come with us, you know? Add to your life. We can make a talk to a girl. You know, get into some trouble. We can do some drugs. Might even get into a fight. Look, we only have so many spins around the sun. And I don't think a job is going to fix whatever's going on up here. I said no. What you doing? Stop. You don't know what you're doing? Stop. So it's no? So no it's no. It's no? Fuck yourself. All right. Have fun. Hey, Trevor. Trevor, got to go over the rules of the house with you, buddy. This is disgusting. <sighs> Trevor, you got it on the doorway, too. I mean, what the hell's going off? Oh, what the hell happened? Uh, it's fine. I'll just stay up. Trevor, what the hell happened? I got to take this. Hello? Yeah. No, no, I think I'll be all right. Well, I know you didn't ask. No, it's fine. I tried telling. OK. He wants to talk to you. Hello. Is this the roommate Kelly? Works in the casino. Brown hair, about 5'9". Kind of schmucky looking. Yeah. Kelly, right? That's your name? Yes. That's a woman's name. So I've been told who is this? Kelly, shut up and listen. Today, you are my man. The good news is I believe in you. The bad news is it's going to be a very difficult day for you. Well, I, uh, I haven't agreed to anything, so... This job is not optional, Kelly. You do this or I have a very scary gentleman put bullets in your eyes. You, you're gonna... you're gonna blind me? Uh, the bullets go straight through my head, so I am up to date with what you're saying. Good. Let's try and stay in the ball. You will deliver four packages today. You will not alert the authorities. You will do whatever the clients want. Are you confused about any of this, Kelly? Uh, well, just think about three simple words. Deal or die. Hey, Kelly, what's your favorite color? Color? Yeah, in um, stressful situations, it's good to think of a color and focus on it. You might have to do that today. It's something somebody taught me when I got started. Yeah, uh... Why are you doing this? Why am I doing this? Why don't you have better fucking questions? Oh, and by the way, you will be watched tonight. So, you know, don't fuck up. You thinking of that favorite color yet, Kelly? No, I, I'm... No, I... I'm drawing a blank, sir. Sir, call me X. Well, don't worry about it. That color will come to you. Good luck today, buddy. Now hand the phone back to Trevor. No, I'm still here. Yeah. Well, I've had kind of a day. Look, I tried. I... All right. OK. Kelly, please be a drug dealer for me. I'm going to text you four addresses. I need you to go to each one of those places and drop off a package. Packages are downstairs in my duffel bag. They're labeled one through four, so you don't get confused. Hey, Kelly. Hey. You got a second? I really don't. I'm sorry. Cool. So um, I was just wanted to make sure that your uh, trash can was a little close to your house because, um, you know, they only give us the two cans. Yeah, it's trash day I'm tomorrow, right? What do we need? Your house. You got it. I'll, yeah, I'll make sure. Yeah. They're starting to charge the fees, and the fees are getting higher, and it's like $10. Well, whatever the fees are, I'll, I'll, I'll pay you back. It's going to be a, it's a lot of money. It's OK. Well, thanks.
I, were you expecting like a package or delivery today? Oh, are you the butt guy? No. I think it's just pot. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, is it free? Uh, <laughs> not free, no, not free. You're supposed to honk? Yeah. Honked. Wait, is Trevor sick? Trevor is stabbed. Oh my. Oh my god, dude. Uh, is he okay? He's fine, he's fine. Oh. <clears throat> yeah. Here, just come in for a second. No, mi miss. I prefer to do it out here. If we could, if we, if we could just do this out here. In the front yard. Come on. Do you have uh, money for this so I can get going? I didn't want to listen to the music. Oh, oh, you didn't want to listen to music. Okay. This doesn't look like it, Nate. I don't know what you two had worked out. Well, we worked out an eighth. An eighth. Uh, well, you just pay me for whatever and it'll come oh, back. I just with pay something. you for this? <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, did, did he give you any more? Uh, I. No, I got it. An eighth is like eight handfuls. Yeah, I, I know. <laughs> so do you have anywhere I can put all this? <laughs> That's not, that's not funny. You know, I, I, if I screw this up, I could get stabbed. Yeah, you definitely would have got stabbed for that. Yeah. <laughs> Did Trevor not give you a scale or anything? No. No. <sighs> you know, I didn't even know Trevor was a drug dealer until today. <clears throat> I'm, I, you know, I don't know how you expect me to know all this. I mean, I'm just a dealer. Uh, you know, like blackjack and poker. And oh, you're a poker dealer? <clears throat> that sounds like a fun job. Yeah, I mean, I hate it. Maybe it's just not in the cards for you. Really? <laughs> it's a good pun. Yeah, I'm a bit of a wild card. <laughs> that's, that's a good one, too. <laughs> Are we, uh, are we almost done here? Not if you play your cards right. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have a girlfriend? Uh, probably. What? Hmm? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh, I mean, yeah, yes, I do, I, I, um, I do, I do not have one at this time. Uh, do you have to, like, oh. Oh. Just take your pants off. Your clothes will be dry in like 20 minutes. Okay. I just hate that I can't go a day without spilling something on myself. You hate a lot of things, huh? 
No, I just... Can that pillow? Sure. I just had bad luck, that's all. Well, maybe that's all you're keeping track of. Down there? Yeah. Fill that in. I just started. Yeah, well, it's very telling. Throw that away forever. And now you're left with that. And what do I do with this? You get super stoked on life. It worked for me. Uh, is that the only reason you got stoked on life? Whoa, what is that? It just like filters out the smell, you know? I don't want it to smell like weed out there. Uh, I don't really think it's working. I mean, are you just putting it out the wall? Do you have roommates who don't like smoke? Is that why? <laughs> uh, my roommate's my dad. Roommate is your dad. Yeah, just for like now, mm -hmm. you know, until I get my feet back on the ground. I was dating this Romanian guy for a second, and he got me on some harder stuff, and I tried to kill myself, and blah, 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 and, and my dad freaked out, and he locked me up in this place. Uh, is your dad cool with you smoking? <laughs> no. Great. Okay. <laughs> I kind of knew that. Um, so, uh, I should probably get going is the thing. Do you, um, you know what? These are his shorts, aren't they? You gave me your dad's shorts. That's <laughs> funny. That's good. Where's my pants? I need to get my pants right now. It's okay. He's not going to be home for a while. I, I don't... What was that? Um, what was that? Uh, okay, I gotta hide. This is the thing. I can't fit on any bed. Uh, what the hell? Uh, what? Closet. Hiding closet. Well, that's where everybody looks. Oh. Uh, just a second. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> hey, Ali, I want to ask you. Smoking pot? What? Where is it? Dad, come on. No, it's it's incense. It's a new scent. <laughs> <clears throat> that you never smelled before. Damn it, Ollie, I know what weed smells like. Where is it? Um, you're not gonna find it. <laughs> Cause there isn't any <laughs> anywhere. Especially not in the closet, Dad. I'm sorry, Kelly. What? You said Kelly. Uh, I did? Well, you don't know what you said? That's weird, Dad. Why would I say that? I don't know. What are you talking about? Who's Kelly? What? Who's Kelly? Does Kelly even know who he is? You know what? I have some friends coming over. Just air out the room, okay? And keep the door shut. We're not done with this. Dad, it was just incense. Jake, get out of here. Okay. 
Is he gonna is he gonna tell your dad that I'm in here? Probably not. He doesn't really talk that much. Okay, alright. Uh I'm going to jail. Um I need to find a way out of here. Hey. Okay, help. Help me. Help. Calm down, dude. What? Uh, Don't tell me to calm down. Don't tell me to calm down right now. How the hell do I get out of this house? I have an idea. Go out the window. Duh. You're high. Whatever, I do it all the time. Just go. You jump out the Come window on. all the Don't. You jump out the window all the time? Yeah. Right, good. <clears throat> just, don't, just clear the bush. What's the part that happens after that? Um, you get up and then you go to the party. Hi, officer. Hi. I know you're not on duty right now, officer, but I, uh, I just saw some suspicious looking characters. Looked like they were uh, breaking into a house in the neighborhood, and I thought I'd bring it to your attention. Okay, uh, where? Where? In the, uh, like, not across the, not across the street, down the road. Show me. Well, they, they, they came in from over that way, and then they drove over here. And then, uh, and then you know, and the thing is, is um, I don't really want to, ooh, I don't want to get involved, you know? You don't want to get involved, but you've already gotten yourself involved, so just tell me which house. Yeah. Well, uh, you see, uh, you see, like, uh, way down there, b pa past that uh, uh, power box? Uh, right. Yeah, well, it's, it's the driveway to the left of that, and... Um, There's no car there in the driveway. No, well, it left, it left, uh, but before it left, how long were you out there watching? Well, that's that's the thing. Is like I had to pay attention to make sure it was real. That's why I came to you after I established. Yes, this is real. Because you're a detective. I just, you know, you know, you said. Good Samaritan. Uh, community watch, sir. Community watch. Community watch. Okay. Mm -hmm. I've never seen you at the meetings before. Well, I do diligence, and I, you know, I work nights. So. All right. Okay. Well, why don't you just head back home, Thank and you. I'll take a look at it. Please do, because uh, it's still. I mean, they just made their way in. All right. Please do. The one right there by the power box. Uh, and I could have swore somebody was like, fire, fire. But, you know, I don't know. So. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. I think we got a problem down the street. Thank you. Did you want something? Just checking everything good? Yeah.
Bathroom. I'm looking for the bathroom. It's a closet. <laughs> After you. Do that. I need to go. Thanks. I think it's a little wobbly. It looks dangerous. Did you just want your ID? Just wait by yourself, okay? Oh, and now you're rolling the window up. A lot of rude rolling going on over there. Sorry. This is 
see you at all. What's I didn't, wrong I don't know with how that you? happened. Just, I just assumed no one was in there. Was there a guy just, in here? I don't understand. Just get out. Know, why are you yeah, trying to understand? Albano is a Chicago. Excuse me. Um, did you see like a, a big guy come out of the bathroom I was just in? I mean, uh, it just, it's not important. Do you have any coffee? Did I see you pull up on a donut? Um, no, oh, spare tire. Yeah, I had a weird flat. You're buying a donut? I don't think the two are related, but yeah. Are you sure about that? I think so. Two ninety five. Oh. This one has shit on it, just like you. <laughs> what? The nickel. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Do you know that it costs eleven point two cents to manufacture a nickel? No, is that true? No, it doesn't make any sense. I know. It's all false. Life's pretty fucked up. Yeah. Have a nice day. Okay. Donut. <laughs> mm. Shit, makes no sense. But it does make a nickel. Actually makes five cents. See, that's the joke. That's what I'll come excuse me, Mr. Remember I said make no sense? It actually makes five cents. It makes a it's like a nickel and you'd find that really funny and fall in love with me and then we'd go home together and probably get married and have two kids, that'd be great. everything. Everything? Yeah, you thought that you spilled jelly donut filling on your pants? You didn't. But you looking actually caused you to spill the donut filling on your pants. It landed in the exact spot I thought it did when it, when it didn't. Yeah. Here's the bad news. Uh, that was the boss's favorite statue. It's a Buddha. Well, it was a Buddha. It represents peace. Now it represents pieces. I'm sorry, am I in trouble? Let me tell you a true story about the boss. So one time the boss was driving, and he got into one of these situations where he was making a U-turn on a green arrow, and there was some guy making a right on a red, follow me, and they almost hit each other. And this guy turning right, he's like freaking out, he's like swearing, you know, uh, you know, road rage. So he decided to follow the guy home at a distance, obviously. When he gets to the guy's house, uh, he notices that he has a boat in his driveway. So the boss leaves, comes back in the middle of the night, and he puts a tracking device on the guy's boat. And like a year goes by. And one day I get a little beep beep, you know, on my phone, and I check it, and guess what? It's this guy. He's taking his boat out to the lake. So I tell the boss, and uh, we decide to take a little trip out to the lake ourselves. We rented two jet skis, and we cruise around looking for the guy. We found him out in the, the middle of the lake. And pardon my pun here, but it's one of my favorite parts of the story. But when the coast was clear, we, uh, we rode up on the boat, um, and we just started shooting. Uh, the Pina Colada song was playing on the boat's radio, I remember. And the boss, the boss was singing along. Killed this, killed this whole family. And then we cruised around on the jet skis for a while, just for fun, you know, jet skis are great. Um, and we came home here, and we watched a Kurosawa movie and uh, shared a popcorn. It was, it was the perfect crime. You have really pretty eyes. Thanks. Don't you have anything you want to say about my eyes? You also have pretty eyes. Thank you. OK, uh, can I ask you a question? And be honest, did you put this statue here? Because I'm pretty sure when I rolled up, it wasn't here. Getting all tense on me? No. All these questions? 
Let me ask you a question. You know any jokes? Do I know any jokes? Yeah, man, jokes. To relieve the tension. Okay. Um, yeah, uh, what did one grizzly say to another grizzly holding a gun on him? Oh, uh, what? What's the matter? Afraid to fight me with your bare hands? I like that. <laughs> you, you calling me a chicken man? No, no. Uh, no chicken men in that joke. Just, just bears. <laughs> that was a second joke. Legit. Okay, this is gonna happen. I'm gonna go get a chicken mask. I'm gonna put it on. I'm gonna come back out here. We're gonna fight with our bare hands. If I win, nothing. You deliver your package, nothing happens. Boring. Uh, but if you win, I will grant you one wish. Deal? Look, you're not a genie, and I am not going to fist fight you, okay? Or anyone, really. I just not my thing. It's not what I like to do, so no, no. Okay, here's the thing, though. If you don't say it's a deal, I'm going to shoot you. I'm going to shoot you right in your, your body, right in the main mass part of your body. I'll just say it's a deal. Okay, deal. Stay put. I'll be right back with the chicken mask. You going to run? Give, give me your car keys. No, I, I wasn't going to Give me your car keys, man. Give me your keys. All right. Thank you. Oh, great catch. Do you think it was a good catch? It was, it was a terrific catch. Thank you. Don't run. I will chase you in your own car. <clears throat> okay, so just to clarify the rules, um, I was only going to kill you for not taking the deal. I'm not going to kill you if you lose this fight. Yeah, okay, good. I'm only being so specific because I don't want you to think that you're fighting for your life. Because that'll give you an unfair advantage. Stakes would be so high that you, you know, ooh. But, to clarify, we're only fighting for the whip. Okay. Come up here. Oh, yeah, cooler place. I'll put this in. Oh, geez, this is so dangerous right. to do that. So. <laughs> What's this? I just thought we were fighting. With a fist. Bare hands. That's like a cat. Yeah. Keep your thumbs in. Go. your wish. Well, I, I wish you wouldn't tell your boss about the statue. Granted. Grab your package, please. Take it to him. I couldn't see at all. I know I made the rules, but it wasn't totally fair. Deja vu, right? No, I've never seen that statue before. Wait here. Did you actually tell him it wasn't me? Or did you just not tell him it was me? Wait. Yeah, no, I told him. Okay. <laughs> My wish was for you to not tell him it was me. Not to specifically tell him that it wasn't me. What's the difference? <laughs> the difference is he has no idea who did it instead of knowing exactly who did it. Um. Oh. Uh. Yeah. You're right. Great. Bye, Shit. Mm-hmm. I guess I feel your wish. Great. It's gonna get a lot of use out of that. All right, let's go. Ooh. Sorry. Ugh. Shit! Are you the guy that didn't break the statue? Yes, sir, that's me. What did you do? I delivered this package. Uh, sit down. Where's the normal guy? 
Uh, I'm just filling in for him. Did you just say filling in as a joke because you saw me spill donut filling on my floor? I, I don't think so. I mean, I, I, do, I don't really know anymore. I, I, no, I'm pretty sure I, I, I don't think so. If I call Mr. X right now, is he going to write me a check for $940 to pay for the broken statue? Or is he going to tell me to shoot you in the stomach with a bow and arrow? Wow. I don't think he's going to say any of those things because they're so specific. I'm thinking he'll probably tell you I'm just filling in for the normal guy, so like a, a third thing. But I'm not looking for a normal guy. I'm looking for someone special. Are you special? I'm not special, okay? I can guarantee that. Everyone thinks they're special. If you don't, that makes you special. Mm, so true. This, guy, this guy's legit, sir. He just kicked my ass outside in the chicken mask, and he also came up with a really great joke, like, on the spot, that had to do with the situation. And the second, even more situational joke, slightly less funny, but even more situational, totally relieved the tension. Relieved the tension, huh? Think we need to take him with us today? Well, there definitely might be some tension. Mm. Definitely might be. Mm. No, you know, guys, um, I'm, I was just here to drop this package off and then I, I gotta get going. What are you, some kind of chicken man, son? Doesn't look like a guy that's afraid to get his hands a little bit dirty. Are you saying that because I have some sort of twinkle in my eye? Or because I actually have dirty hands? <laughs> <laughs> this guy's legit. I know you broke the statue. What's his name says you uh, didn't do it, but obviously that means you did. I mean, I didn't even know we had any statues on this property, but if you broke it, then you're legit, which what's his name says you are, then I, I'm forced to force you to follow the rules so you, you don't lose your legitimacy and, and get murdered by us. Francis. You love birds, I guess. You love anything enough you'd want to put it on a statue with you? Well, not that I can think of. Do you? Of course. Mind if we uh, take your car? I'd prefer if we didn't. I'm driving on a donut, you know, spare tire, and they actually tell you not to drive on those things for too long. you who was angry at me, but you were the one who was wrong. I had a green arrow. I was in a lane where a U-turn is legit. Totally legit. You were making a right on red. But you honked at me. You made an obscene gesture. What do you have to say about these things? I'm sorry. I didn't know. No need to apologize. <sighs> Everything you did made sense. You were acting naturally. Anger is natural. Unfortunately, you didn't follow the rules, and me and what's his name here, we are strict on rules. We don't care if you make sense or if the rules make sense. 
All that matters is once we establish the rules, you don't break them. And you did. Which makes you very unlegit. Look, you don't know. <laughs> How are you going to feel when we get out there and that Pina Colada song is playing on the boat's radio? Terrible. Yeah. Can I ask you a question and be honest? Are you going to kill me when you get done killing all them? Well, let, let me ask you a question. Would it be the perfect crime if we let you live after this? No. Sorry, man. I, I wish, I wish that you would kill your boss instead of me. We still got a wish. Yeah, you do. Grant, what's this now? I owe him a wish. And he just wished for me to kill you instead of him. Shit. It was legit? Yeah, it was fair and square. We had a deal. Deal with the dealer. Well, it's all right with you. It's like my last word to be the F word. It's been a good life. A lot of beautiful women. I had running water the whole time. Pizza, burritos, ice cream whenever I wanted. Yeah, even the pharaohs don't get ice cream. You know where the money is. You have my blessing to take it all. I just have one request. Take a little bit of it, build a, a statue of me eating ice cream. It'd be my great pleasure, sir. Well, what's his name? It's been legit as fuck. Kill you now? Yes. No. You're covered because you said instead of me in your wish. Okay, good. So we can go. We can go home then. We don't have to kill a family. We can... Oh, well, no, that we have to vote on. We have to vote on whether or not to kill the family. Yeah. Why well, vote no? Oh, well, I have to vote yes. So I guess it's going to be a coin flip. You got, you got a coin? I got, uh... I saw you put one in that little baggie with the wallet and your phone. Yeah. I, 
got a nickel. Perfect. All right. Heads, we kill that small family. Tails, we head back. Oh, actually, heads should be head back because it's the same word. Heads. So heads is head back, and tails, we kill the small family. Flip it. Uh. You have to flip the nickel. Don't try to drop it or cheat or something. You're covered from the wish, but I'll still kill you for being unlegit if you try to cheat. Yeah, I, 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 I was just thinking that uh, you said that heads means heads back. Well, the backside of heads is tails, so tails is heads back, literally. Holy shit, I love that. Okay, definitely. Tails is heads back, literally and figuratively. Or maybe they're both literal. Either way, definitely tails his head back. Flip it. Did you know that it, it costs 11.2 cents to make a nickel? Wait, what? Is that true? That's terrible. That makes no sense. Well, it might not make any sense, but it does, it does make five. Incredible! Yeah. That is such a good joke. Yeah. It related to the situation so much. Uh -huh. You keep stalling with clever wordplay because you're trying to relieve the tension and save that small family? Absolutely. Wow. That's legit. You know what? I gotta reward that kind of behavior. Granted. What? I, yeah, I changed my vote. I vote no. You vote no. I vote no. <laughs> You just saved that small family. <laughs> you just saved them. That's great, man. That's great. That's... I vote no. Can I ask you a question? Would that Pina Colada song really be playing on that boat if we went over there? Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Should we cruise around on these jet skis for a while just for fun?
What the fuck are you doing? I, uh... Who are you? What, what is this? Look, I just came to... You're not Patrick. No, I'm Kelly. Trevor's... You don't know that, Patrick. No, uh, look, I got the wrong... Oh, do you fix me up? Do what? Oh, oh, Trevor, my ass. Is that my box? Uh... Yeah. Come in. Yes, come in. Uh, come on. I gotta go soon, uh, though, you know? So, so, so. Have you been here before? Uh, to this hotel? Yes. No, I haven't. This is a good place for this, right? <clears throat> uh, I was told uh, $300. $300? That's what X was saying. Yeah, I don't know the whole really? thing. Yep. Okay. Okay. $300. There it is. Okay. Yep. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is uh, my aunt. We are on vacation. Hello. All right, have a, you have a good vacation. Wait. You take the drive with me. What? We do it together, all of us. <laughs> no, no, thank you. I'll give you another $300. To take drugs with you? This one. Yes. For me, just for myself, three hundred. Yeah. <laughs> this one, yes. Yeah. You? Yeah. I can't. I can't. I'll give you another five hundred dollars. Five hundred dollars, huh? Really? If that is your price. Uh, I, I don't. I don't even know what it is. What it is? It is. It is, a dust, a powder, herbal, from the flower in the jungle. You snort it up your nose. Mm -hmm. Why do you want to take drugs with me? <laughs> It is what we do. I mean, it's fun. We want to have fun. We want company. I just, you know, okay, it's... I, uh, it only lasts 15 minutes, stops. I, no, I, I'm... Uh, I'll give you $1,000. You, you're going to give me $1,000? Yes, I am. For 15 minutes? 15 minutes. Is this some kind of sex thing? Sex? Tram. Sex room. Right? What, 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 what is this? No, 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 no. It, 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 is, just, it, it is just a powder from the jungle. Mm. What does it do? It's, 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 it's nice. It's like a body high. It's, it's very nice. Body high. So I'm not going to go crazy or no, something, right? No, no. It, it makes you relax. It soothing. Clears you, I promise. I know Trevor. You can trust me. Fifteen minutes? Fifteen minutes. One thousand dollars. Yeah, okay. We're gonna... <laughs> okay, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. just some trying okay. to get out. Yeah, that's fine. But I can't do a lot. I can't do it because I got yeah. things to do today. Yeah. You know. Oh. Sink in that chair a little bit. Yeah. You know, I've actually never done anything like this before. Yeah. She's gonna, she's gonna do it too? Yeah, sweet old time. This is a very special night.
<clears throat> Jesus, that that burn. Oh yes, the burn. <laughs> <clears throat> so how long does it? Uh, huh? How long does this take to? Uh, Fifteen minutes. No, no. Uh, not how long are we gonna? <clears throat> how long is it? Uh, uh,
okay, I'm gonna run ahead, I'm gonna start the truck. I'm gonna start the truck and pull you onto the front. Wait one minute. And then you come out. You put it in the back of the truck, you will go to Luxor. I don't. No, no, no. property of the hotel, you can't take the eel. I don't know what's going on. You come over here right now, and you leave that eel on this desk. I'm sorry, I can't. I'll call the police then. Uh, right, okay, 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 all right. All right. He said he was calling the police. Uh, uh, well, look, I see. Motherfucker! You know what I'm saying? I put this inside of you. 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 I put this inside of you
I just, uh, what, what's going on? What, hold on, hold on a second, hold on. Let's use our words. I just, hold on. You. Hello? All right, problem solved. Well, yeah, no problem. Well, I didn't know you had me followed all day. Yeah, I told you that at the beginning. Well, he's a big, scary guy. I mean, I could have used his help on it. What? Is this tricks? Is this what you're doing? You're playing tricks on me? Just admit that you're having fun. Well, no, no. No? Let... no? May I ask you a question, please? Sure. I've done three out of four. Can you please just let me go home? You're doing great. I didn't ask you to kill one of my competitors. I mean, that was really something. I never would have thought you were a killer. No, that wasn't me. That was a, a man in a chicken mask. Oh, you're not kidding. You really do need some sleep. I'm serious. That's something that really happened to me. Are you sure you're not on drugs? I don't do drugs. Yes, I just did drugs with the Romanian, but, you know, he told me it was herbal, and, you know, it offered me more money I've ever seen. Yes, but it didn't kill you, right? I mean, I'm guessing that some part of you even enjoyed it. I mean, listen to you. You sound like a brand new man. You're loving this, right? Isn't this exciting? I don't want to do this anymore. I just want to go home. Well, this isn't over, Kelly. Look, I understand. You need encouragement, right? And I'm betting that if I threatened to kill you right now, you'd welcome it. So what if I were to tell you that I once stood in that exact same spot you're standing in right now? I can remember a time in my life where I lived in a boring, go-nowhere kind of world. Dreams, sure, but no will to get there, no drive. I needed that push. And one day, I got just that. And what I learned, what you're learning now, it will make you a better person. Well, I don't feel like a better person. All right, well, I guess I'm not great at giving motivational speeches. Fuck it. How about you just finish up? Or what? Fuck, it's cold. Mmm. So what's up? Are you your Brody? Yep. Okay, well, this is yours and I'll uh just... oh, that's oh my god. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. I'm just gonna I'll talk to you. Hey, where are you going? Uh they told me you were paid up and you were fine, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna Oh wait, 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 I'm, I'm sorry. You can't just leave. Why? Just sit down. Take a seat. Relax. What's your name? <laughs> I'd rather not say. My friends call me Bear. Mm -hmm. My name is Brody. Brody Hobbs. You can call me Brody. Just call me Brody. When can I leave, Brody? <laughs> 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 You're a real killer, aren't you? 
got a set on you, Trevor. I mean. Trevor? My name's Kelly. You shouldn't have said that. Kelly? I said they were sitting over at Trevor. So like a code name or something? Uh, it doesn't matter. You could be Sally, you could be Jane. <sighs> Have you uh, ever sold drugs to an undercover cop? <laughs> yeah, no, not lately. Uh, funny thing is I actually um, I haven't done anything like this before. Yeah, that's real. <clears throat> okay. First thing is, I've just been dropping off the boxes. So when you opened it up, I didn't know that was in there. You didn't really give me any money, so there's no exchange of goods and services. It's not really a, a, a drug hey, deal. You can't really arrest hey, me. Hey, 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 look, uh, look, look. I'm not going to do anything to you. Cheer up, Sally. Know this, though. I'm the real deal. You're not going to leave until I allow it. And I'm not going to allow it until you help me do what I need to do tonight. The thing is, that what do you want me to do? Temporary boss is connected to some really powerful people. I don't even know him. And tonight we're gonna help him. Because we're all part of the machine, bro. And when the machine breaks down, we break down. Let's go. Let's go. Fucking machine. Yeah, yeah, hold on. Yes, sir, keys. Call me Brody. Call you Brody? Thought I could call you Bear. Nah. You haven't earned it yet. What's this thing? Relax. I'm... This is my thing. Don't touch the rabbit's foot. Right. Relax. Yeah. You couldn't find somebody else to come on this ride? Nope. The partner is supposed to come, but he could make it. Just need some support. We got business to take care of. Let's just say there's a clearing in the competition tonight. Mr. X wants to do it legally, though, you know, drug busts and such. But I heard you're a real stone cold killer, Sally. Oh, fuck it, man. Yeah, well, fuck all that. Sally, you awake? Sally. Yeah, I just... What? Scream. Thank you. What are we doing specifically? You're gonna help me out tonight. It's not hard work. You're gonna sit silently right next to me and not say one word. No cowboy killer shit, okay? Yeah. I need you to be smooth. Be America's favorite. Buckle, Sally. Buckle? How are you with stress? Risky <sighs> situations. You ever been shot? <laughs> no. Okay, maybe what I heard about you wasn't correct. It's fine. I haven't been shot either. <laughs> now I want to try out that experience. You feel me? Yeah, I, uh, I feel you. Oh, hey, what? What the hell was that? Can't flinch. Can't flinch, bro. Let's try it again. I... What? You can't... You can't fucking flinch. It looks like you're gonna fucking hit me, Brody. Exactly. Everyone in there is gonna look like they want to kill you. You need to stop acting like a bitch. <sighs> so you're telling me that... that I mean, are they gonna want, they're gonna want to fucking kill me? No. Okay. Not if you act like a man, someone that knows danger. I thought you were a killer, man. <laughs> you were a killer. Shit. You know danger? I know of it. All right, this isn't gonna work. I have an idea. I have an idea. We got like 10 minutes, let's go. Come here. We got an idea. Follow me, come here.
last person that did that now has only one eye. You heard? That's so. He was missing it before I ever got there, so. So what's up? Why am I waiting here? You can serve me dinner, drinks. What's going on? Where's Tommy? I'm supposed to meet Tommy. Tommy couldn't make it tonight. Security concerns. He thanks you for your patience in these trying times. <laughs> what do I call you? Daddy. Oh. You just call me Daddy. Don't you have to be looking after the floor? I didn't take my medication. The lights give me seizures and shit. Plus, my feet have been killing me. I got that cough that's been going on. Just shut up. Shut the fuck up. I'm really glad I can be part of your guys' HR meeting. I'm supposed to deal with the guy I dealt with before. I don't know you, I don't deal with you. That's a shame. Yeah, it is a real shame. You lost out tonight. Let's go. Get up. Take a seat. And I'll see what your deal is. So I got your attention. Take a seat. I don't know you, I don't deal with you. And if it looks good, I'll get you Tommy. Okay. That's what we got. Seriously, guys, it's great, uh, and I'm thankful, but uh, I just got done doing a lot of crazy drugs, and I'm all messed up, and I, I baptized some eel. You have a problem? Don't talk to my boy like that. Do the line. Do the line. Okay. I think all the bills. Thank you. It's good, right? It's good shit, right? Cowboy 
killer shit. I told you about that. What? Look who it is. Bear, what the fuck is happening in here? Um, I don't know. Maybe if you were here a little bit ago, none of this would have happened. Why'd you call me? I was. So this cocksucker smashed a bottle over his head. Did that happen? Yeah, it happened. You know why? Because your boy was reaching for the gun. So my boy smashed his fucking head with a bottle. This motherfucker doped him up with a bunch of cocaine. Of course it happened. That happened. Didn't know these two inbred fucks were loose cannons. Jesus. Put the gun down, kid. You're gonna hurt yourself. Don't put that down. Don't you put that fucking gun down. Give the boy some cash. Got ourselves a deal. Super loose over we can go. Got ourselves a deal. They're gonna give us what we want. Oh, thanks. Thanks. Yeah. All right. What's that? It's my beeper. Who the hell has a beeper? Shut the fuck up. Okay. I just don't think right now. Get down on the ground now! Don't you fucking move! Don't fucking move! We got what we need. Go. Go. Don't even look at me! You're both fucking dead! Do that, Brody. Run. Take my phone. Oh, strobe lights give you seizures and shit, huh? Should have taken your medicine. What's up? I've never had the pleasure of killing a cop before. 
Thank you, officer. Hey. his ass. <laughs> real, real bad. One punch? One punch. <laughs> You're a killer, Sally. Man. Kelly. Thanks. Thank you. you help take out a bad guy tonight? Well, helping another one. No. You helped me. You helped me. Going all the way to the top, not stopping. What do you mean, Mr. X? That, um, that was my partner's. He got shot today in the middle of the street. Mr. X is gonna trust you now. He's the guy on the inside. Think about it. Brody. Bear. Call me Bear. I just want to stay out of trouble for the rest of my life, so if you could just let me walk away. You go. Here. Get out of here. Yeah? Go. Seriously? Get out of here. Thanks. Now. Get out of here before I change my mind. Hey, Kelly. Yeah. I'll see you soon. Too far over, man. So when they come and take this today, they're gonna mark that down on their list. Get out of my face! Oh no, no, no! I did the four jobs. I did everything he told me to do. Why are you still here? Call him up on the phone. Tell him I'm done with this. Get the camera out of my face. I'll kick your ass. Look at my face! You know the kind of day I've had. Cause let me tell you something. I'm not scared of you guys anymore. After. <laughs> Sorry about that zap, but I just want to say congratulations face to face, you know? Your phone call would have been fine. <laughs> I love this guy. You kill me. I am done though, right? Sure. Okay, so you didn't bring me to this place to like shoot me or whatever. Oh no. <laughs> no, I know, this place is scary, but no, you're fine. So Well, this is crazy what I'm gonna ask you, especially because. Well, Kelly, you're a horrible drug dealer. I mean, just the worst. It's like bananas how fucking bad you are. But I want to offer you another job. I know, I know. You're probably saying no on repeat inside your head right now. Well, no, what, what I'm saying on repeat inside my head are the questions I've been asking all night, okay? Like, why me? Why did you do this to me? Well, I don't have to explain myself to you. Let's see. What will solve the mystery for you? I picked you, Kelly, quite frankly, because I can. And <laughs> there's not a fucking thing you can do about it. Well, how do you know that? I got all your adventures right here. I'm gonna add them to my collection when I get home. You're quite the criminal. 
Pacific. It's almost like I've done this before. Well, I, look, you guys don't have to worry about me. Oh, I know that, Kelly. I was just curious if you'd ever considered doing this for me, you know, like on a regular basis. Uh, uh, I understand. You've had a stressful night. You need to think about it. I'll tell you what. If the answer is yes, answer that phone. If not, then that's that. Yeah. Uh, hey, what's your favorite color? Uh, green. <laughs> Just like me. How about that? Genuine pleasure doing business with you, Kelly. Trevor? Fuck. Are you dead? Oh. Oh. Kelly? Yeah, man. Hey. How's your day? Had a bad day, Trevor. I had a bad day. Take anything that I wanted, take everything that I could. 